we have created a working prototype that allows social workers to provide remote assistance to check the state of the elderly persons who live alone in real time. On the remote social worker side, we only need a mobile smartphone and a cheap uh, Google Cardboard to connect to the service. On the side uh, where is the elderly in need, we will have our cheap uh, Roomba robot that we will be able to control thanks to a Raspberry Pi, a mobile smartphone and a cheap 360 camera. We want that this technology comes integrated with the commercial Roomba robots by default, so there won't be any difficult setup process. Let's see how it works. First, on the remote social worker side, we use the smartphone and the Google Cardboard to connect with the robot. Now we are streaming live from the 360 camera in the top of the Roomba robot and we can freely look around. Next, in order to move the robot, we will have this control panel that will allow us to rotate it, move it forward and backward. As you can see, I have pressed the forward button and the robot will go forward slowly for a few seconds. There is a short delay in the reaction of the video stream that will be improved with a better streaming server. Let's add to the video what is happening on the robot side. Here, I send a command to the robot to rotate to the right. You can see how the live video feed catch up with a delay of a few seconds. So, with these basic commands and some patience, I am able to check the whole place to verify that everything is in order. Thanks to the latest improvements in cheap microcomputers like a Raspberry Pi, the upcoming mobile network 5G technology and the easy access to virtual reality, it will be possible that these and other amazing projects that will bring people closer together even if each person is thousands of miles apart.